The Electronic Vehicle Inspection EVIS system was rolled out at Sukai's Diesel Service Limited in Charlieville. Minister of Works and Transport Rohan Sinanan said after two to three weeks of testing, EVIS was a success. Minister Sinanan said EVIS will ensure transparency in the process of inspecting vehicles, as in the past, persons would obtain inspection stickers in a corrupt manner without taking the vehicle to an inspection garage. In order for a vehicle to get that sticker, they must present themselves as one of the pits or an inspection garage. He said the system will include the use of handheld devices with software that remotely connects to the licensing division to provide access to accurate real-time data through the new inspection sticker that includes a barcode. It will provide access to shared information among all stakeholders. A police officer, a transport officer, or even our traffic wardens who are in possession of the devices will be able to pick up vehicles that should not be operating. And also, they will also be able to pick up drivers who should not be driving. The minister is hoping to crack down on extra heavy T vehicles and overweight vehicles with the EVIS system, as he said these vehicles are being driven on routes that they aren't licensed to drive on. One of the areas that I've asked the Transport Commissioner to look at and uh, the, the Chairman of the uh, Transport Board is that whether we could deregister these trucks once they are caught on routes that they were not licensed for. The Minister said in some instances the contractors who are then tasked with repairing the roads are the ones damaging the roads in the first place. Mahalia Joseph Wharton, TTT News.